Hey y'all, what's going on? I told y'all I would be back, so don't think I'm just a rerun. And I feel like I'm sooty. I'm really not, y'all. I don't know why I'm reading oily, like, for real. Like, I don't know. Anywho, so I said I was going to come in and talk about these Ben Nye powders. Now, deliberately, I did not get banana because I don't see the need for banana on my skin tone. I'm sorry. I don't want it in my life. They can have it. Like, I'm, I'm not here for banana. I'm just not, you know, and, and I don't doubt anybody who uses it or whatever. I just don't personally want it, you know, for me, you know, get down, have you get down. It just is not for me. I don't want it for me, you know. So anywho, um, there's two more that I am waiting on to come. I'm trying to think, is it two more? Yeah. I know Sienna or something like that is one of them because I didn't have it in at the time. And I think one more other one. I can't. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just one more. Anywho, so the ones that I have, and I do have the smaller ones again. Y'all know I'm the only one who's going to be using them. I'm not going to be highlighting every day or whatever the case may be, you know. But I wanted to get some that were, you know, what I thought was comparable for me. This first one is, and this is the luxury. What is that? This is from the luxury powder. I guess they have. I don't know if they have different renditions or whatever. I know what the other one is. It's that neutral white one, like a translucent. This is nutmeg. So, and it is the shaker or whatever. So, and I suggest when you put these tops on or whatever, you know, just be careful with them because you don't want to spill them or whatever and have a mess. Um, this is how that looks. I'm going to like get some and put on my, if y'all can see that, just kind of put on my hand. Don't know if y'all can see that or not. Okay, hopefully y'all can see that. Okay, now that is, um, what I said this was? This one is nutmeg, which I think is a really beautiful color. I think, um, you know, a deeper skin tone than myself could definitely use this as a highlight. It would look natural and really, really pretty. Now, if you want to see a really good video of someone that is, you know, highlights and use these powders and, and, you know, just which is one of the people that I look at is look to when it comes to makeup. And that is color beautiful because she always seems to highlight just enough. Not to mention, her eye looks are everything to me, you know, so it is what it is. Um, you could definitely check her out. I think she may have talked about these a little bit, but she's used these. And one of the first that I seen talk about them or whatever myself personally, before all of this, you got a banana, 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 you know, this whole bit, you know, so definitely check her out. Color Beautiful. I, I, I absolutely love her channel you know, and all of that. But I think she may have also talked about this, I think. But this one I thought was really, really nice. And I think for the most part, from what I'm getting, you kind of let it sit on and bake, as the girls would say. And I'm going to use this little miniature uh, fan brush. And you kind of let it sit on. And you take one of those little V little things and put it under there. And then just kind of dust it off, you know, for that subtle hint of highlight. Now, you know, we don't even know what it is. Child. I can't even see that my damn self. I think it's right here. Yeah. It's just a little hint of something, but you got to remember, you don't want to go out looking like you getting ready to be on RuPaul's Drag Race, as Miss Mystique Summers would say. Shout out to my sister. Don't do it. Just don't do it. Thank you very much. Like, I think this is really, really subtle. You can't see it. I just don't need to. I can't. Okay. Let, let me move on. Uh, <laughs> okay, y'all. This one is um, caramel. And this is another one of the, I guess, luxury powders. I don't know if they had different brands. But this is caramel. This is as yellow as I want under here. Like, can I just, that's it? You know, for just a little subtle highlight or whatever on a, you know, day-to-day -day basis and what I think works for, you know, my skin tone or whatever, you know. So, let me put some of this on and 
just kind of, you know, so y'all can see. Like, I just think this is enough for me. And as you can see, it has like a yellow tone to it. And I am tickled to death right now I'm thinking about my state. And it has like a yellow tone to it. Now, apparently you're supposed to let that sit on and bake. So we will say that this has baked. Okay. And remember, this is where I said. So I'm just going to kind of brush across it with this little miniature like. And hopefully you can see. Now, see, that is as bright as I ever want to be under my eyes. Like, really. And I got that light beaming on it. So. Just pulling it back, you can kind of see where it's at, and I may not have let it bake long enough, but that's as bright as I need it to ever get. Thank you. Hallelujah. Bougie, really? Bougie. So, you know, that's, yep. that's caramel. Okay. So, next is, is Bougie shading me, y'all? I think Bougie shading me. Bougie is shading me. Like, can I just say that? The next one, and I think this is an absolutely lovely color. This is clay. Again, kind of yellowish brown. Um, next to the caramel, you can tell, I you can pretty much tell the difference in what this is clay and that's caramel. You can tell the difference. Um, the caramel is, you know, it's got that yellow tone to it. That's as yellow as I want it to be. Like, I can't. Okay. Now, let me kind of swatch and go somewhere else for this clay over here on this side. All right. <clears throat> Can't wait to get Sienna. I really am looking forward to getting that. And there's clay. Clay, to me, is a mixture of caramel and nutmeg mixed together. It, it, it kind of is a perfect mixture, you know, uh, to me. You know, as far as I'm concerned. Um, so I'm going to, as you can see where I have that at. I'm just going to kind of dust that. And I know I'm not letting these bake. So Miss Mystique might be like, girl, you did not cook. I did. <laughs> um, it's, well, it's a little bit there, I guess, if, you know, we were under the light. To me, it's another one that's perfect. Like if you in the light or whatever, you can see it. Just a subtle hint of it, not too much, just a little something, you know, which was why I went for these colors. I thought they would be, you know, better for me. Again, I am waiting on Sienna, I think it is, and the neutral color. And that's as far as I want to go. Like, they can take banana and shove it as far as I'm concerned, you know, really. Would I suggest these? Yes. If you, you know, are not a makeup artist or you're not freelance, excuse me, freelancing or anything like that. Do I think you need that bigger one? No. Now, if you like, some people like, again, Mystique, she does shows and this and that and other. So, of course, she's always highlighting. So, the bigger one is definitely, you know, in order. Y'all, am I getting sick? Y'all, that's nasty. I'm not going back. So, we're going to pay it on that one. Anywho, so, these are the ones that I like for my community. You know what I'm saying? And they did have, they have other ones, y'all. It's just, and if you like banana, go for banana, you know? But I'm just not here for it for me. And, you know, I, I, I'm i not for down anyone who does like it or whatever. It's just not going to work for me. I'm not going to be able to do it, you know? And I want to show you another one that I have. Well, actually, two. One of them is a blush, y'all, but I use it as a highlight. Y'all going to be like, much love, sit your ass down. Now, this is this um this is uh autofocus. This is uh face front, face front cosmetics or whatever. Major highlighted. You hear me? Um just to give you an idea, I'm going to go ahead and whip this out right now. The only thing is, is that I don't even like y'all will probably never see this. The only thing this was good for was, in which I didn't even have to have it, was photo shoot. <clears throat> so, if I can get this out. Yeah, I'm trying to get it out without causing an, causing an issue. 
I'm going to pat that right there. And just to show, yeah. So this is not to be played with. Probably will never really get used unless I whip out Miss uh, Malaysia. Y'all know my drag alter ego. If Malaysia ever has to hit the scene, then yeah. What is that all on? Yeah, I'm telling y'all, this lighting is just, oh, I hate it. Anywho, that's it. That's what it looks like. Now, we're going to brush this out. Let me tell y'all something. Never, okay, like for real. This is way too much. And I brushed that off. Like, that's what banana gives me. Like, that that's giving me banana teas. You know, I don't even know. I think it would be cute as a highlight if you're doing some drama. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever. But you would have to take so very little of it that it wouldn't even be funny. Now, the other one is a Jane blush that I live for. And I got this from Pink Porn Star. And y'all don't, I don't know if I'm ever going to find these again ever in life. And this one is Be Pure and it's a Jane mineral blush. I probably won't. Um, let's see. Let me see if I can get some out of here. Okay, I'm put it right about there. Um, hopefully y'all will be able to see that right there. Oh, right there. I love this as a highlight for me. It just kind of works for me. I love it. If I want a little highlight, to me, it seems like if I use a highlight, wherever I use it at, I'm going to get sooty. You know, so I, you know, try not to really even get into it and do that. Like, for real. I try not to do it. I just really do. I try not to do it. But if I'm going to, I'm going to definitely use that Jane. Um, I also like, let's see, the one that, um, the Candlelight Glow. The Candlelight Glow by Too Faced. Yes. I like that one. Um, I also like the one by, and I can kind of reach for that and get this one, um, the one that uh, the bomb makes, which I'm sure they make several different ones. My first, you know, encounter with that was when I bought this, the last bomb palette that I bought, and it's the Disco Solid Gold, which is that right there, that highlight. I think it's a gorgeous color can be as a, you know, you know, put it under your brow. But that's it as a highlight. I think if you wanted to and you was really trying it, honey, you could probably put that on your eye and it'd be a really pretty, you know, color or whatever. But they definitely have this in as a highlight. So this has some pretty colors in it. Um, this palette, I was kind of disappointed with... Um, Really only one that was disappointed with, and that's this one right here. Like, I don't know what the purpose of this is. I, I, I just don't. And I guess if you pack it on with some milk, it could work or whatever. It does have some really pretty lippies in it. And a cute little blush. So, anywho, so that's it. I wanted to share that with y'all on, you know, my spiel with the um Ben Eye palettes or whatever. I personally like the eyeshadows as well too, but y'all won't see me doing the banana or whatever. But again, I won't be, you know, I, I wouldn't down anyone, you know, never for using it. It's just not for me. And I've seen it out in daylight and it's absolutely hideous. You know, so there it is. So, but I do suggest these if you are my, you know, my complexion, a deeper or a little bit lighter or whatever, I definitely suggest these. And, you know, by all means, go over and check out um, Color Beautiful, you know, because I think she, I, I love her makeup, that's it. But she does such a superb job when it comes to highlighting and not overdoing it. You know what I mean? Like, she just has that right mixture, as well as uh, Miss Mystique Summers from RuPaul Drag Race. I have to mention that. I'm sorry, Mystique. Um, does a too much highlight and contour and, you know, one for, you know, the queens and one for, you know, just real fish, you know. And I think that's a really, really, really good video. So, y'all, I know this probably didn't have no damn baddie. 
But again, like I said, over here, I'm just, you know, when it comes to makeup, I'm just sharing with y'all what I like or whatever. When it comes to doing it, yeah, tutorials is not what you get over here, right? Okay, this is where I'm learning. All right. So I'm out of here, y'all. Much love. Bye.